Hello, what's up everyone? I'm back again with another video tutorial. Today in this video tutorial, I'm bringing you guys this new app. It's called Font Art. So basically, what's Font Art? Font Art is this new app that's been very popular on iOS and because of its customizability and its new fonts, colors that it offers. So basically, if you go to the App Store and look at this, um, you know, app, there is the subscription based method and it also got some free uh, options with it too. A lot of free options, not some free options. And yeah, once you go there, it's, it has a lot of customization ability, which I, we don't really uh, find that much in iOS. So I'll go hop on the, to the app and then I'll show you that what is there to find. So basically this is here is this fonts and as you see as you can see there's custom you can also add custom fonts such as you find something on the internet you can go ahead and load it into this app and then you can use it but there is also the standard fonts so you can just use the fonts that they offer or you can download the fonts that they can you know basically they you, that you can get from their store so right now I'm going to go to the standard and as you can see there's a bunch of of new fonts that you can use so basically you would say how to use so basically they, they, you would see an option there it says type something here so when you type something here it's gonna appear beneath there in these style of fonts so I'll go and add there for example I'll type in hello world just for the example of for the sake of this tutorial so it, then you'll see that it uh, starts to appear in different styles in here and I can just simply copy the one that I like and go ahead and paste it in any app then it will appear as it is appearing here basically it won't change because the app's different it will use the same uh, style the same um, design so that, let me copy one and I'll go to notes and there I'll paste one so as you can see it appears as it was looking in the app so yeah that's the first thing that you can get from this app is basically you can just simply go ahead type something copy it and paste it if you want to use it as your you know uh, use these characters these special characters or this special design of f fonts in let's suppose your username or you uh, gamer tag or something like that but uh, um, beyond that there is also a custom keyboard if you go on into the app and enable it so basically what will happen is you click on this um, button here that globe button and you can uh, you will see multiple keyboards you can select the one where it says fonts art if you have multiple ones then it's going to appear there so basically after that you can also type in from the exact spot you can just simply select the fonts on the top drawer of the keyboard and from there you can just type in and say there is the example right there on the screen and beyond that there's also this option of multiple themed keyboards so there are some free ones and then there are the paid ones basically you if you took the subscription then you can use the paid ones and there is pretty much a lot to offer in this app you can just use any theme as I'm using in this video and you can just go ahead with your taste with your own style and not just keyboard there's much more than this app offers such as themes now you might say what's themes well I have another video too I'll link it up in the description that's also on how to customize your iPhone but here in this one as you can see you can select any theme and just go ahead and install it once you click on install themes it's gonna just take some time take some loading and then here it appears so basically there are some guidelines for the installation icons basically you go ahead and select the icons which you want to replace with so as you know you can't uh, customize the icon of the apps as you do in uh, Android but there is an uh, alternative way where you create shortcut for the apps that you want to use icons for and the shortcuts can have any kind of appearance that you want so here you have to select all the icons that you want to use the customized look for so simply just check them and then what's going to happen is uh, you can go ahead and then inst select install selected icons then it's going to replace the icons for them and then it's going to basically uh, uh, use the shortcut instead of this and for that it creates a profile so you know to, to make the changes automatically you will have you will need a custom profile so for that you will have to go here and click prof uh, download it profile and from here you will have to download it uh, install it actually into your passcode and then click install so once it's installed so basically what's going to happen is it can also do the device management and stuff and as you can see it all it automatically changed the appearance for the app and now you got the customized look so you can go in detail you use uh, select a variety of apps and then you can go ahead and customize your phone to uh, 
you know the limits that you want to basically the sky is the limit you can go with the app if you buy the subscription then there is a lot more that they can offer not just icons then there are widgets too then there are other options that they offer you can go ahead and install them too so basically they use the uh, local host uh, profile uh, method where it's automated that you don't have to do anything manually it just automatically does the theming for you and this way you can go ahead and make it look the way you want and as i was saying there's a lot more than that there's the home screen there are the widgets and everything you can go ahead and try it for yourself and you can see what you find good about this app what you don't and yeah make sure to drop it down in the comment section what you think of this app and drop a like if you think this video is worth it subscribe for more videos like this one and yeah i'll see you in the next one peace